right now at 5.30, an update to a consumer alert we first brought you on the, on the morning show. Potentially dangerous levels of metals inside the fruit juice that you've probably given to your children. Consumer Reports tested dozens of juices and found many are considered risky. Since that report came out at 6 o'clock, we've been looking at the better juice options for your kids. And also what you can do as a parent to change the way that juice is regulated in the future. Melanie Lawson has a list of the best options out there. But first, we begin with Elizabeth Campbell, who looked into the potential dangers for children and also adults. Elizabeth. Well, what's very concerning is out of the more than 40 juices that were tested by Consumer Reports, the majority of them are from a wide variety of common brands from very common stores. And if you see the words like organic, all natural, 100% juice, that does not mean it's in the clear because, for instance, this Trader Joe's organic apple juice, this organic whole foods grape cranberry, and this Welch's 100% grape juice all made the list of concern. You can find it in every grocery store, even big box stores, drug stores, and more. Juice. Do you allow them to have juice? It's not my favorite. I prefer water, but we do buy the Honest brand, and I've started to let them uh, take it for lunch. Nikki Holmes has four kids under age 11 and was shocked when I told her that many popular juice brands contain high levels of cadmium, lead, mercury, and inorganic arsenic, some of the most potentially harmful metals to your health. It's a risk to adults and or children. A Trader Joe's organic apple? Kids could be at risk for lowered IQ, behavioral problems like ADHD, type 2 diabetes, and cancer. And even modest amounts of these metals in adults could raise the risk of bladder, lung, and skin cancer, cognitive and reproductive problems, and type 2 diabetes. Consumer Reports says the solution is cutting out juice, or at least cutting back. The American Association of Pediatrics says children younger than one shouldn't have any fruit juice. One to three year olds should have no more than four ounces a day, six ounces for four to six year olds and eight ounces for seven year olds. My kids have had an occasional Mott's or Minute Maid, but uh, we're going to have to have a conversation. Definitely caught off guard by some of these on there. I am Elizabeth. Wow. Consumer Report says overall the amount of metals that are found in these juices has improved since the last time they did similar testing in 2011, but they still say there is so much room to improve. And a juice similar to this, 10 ounces, is more than any age is recommended to have per day. If you want to see the list of all the juices, including the ones that have the highest percentage of these metals, you can head to newsforjacks.com. Reporting live this evening, Elizabeth Campbell, Channel 4, the local station. Elizabeth, so, I mean, what would it take for the companies to lower the levels of these metals that have been found in their juices? Tarek, the, uh, excuse me, Consumer Reports says that it's really up to government restrictions, restrictions by the FDA, and they say right now there aren't a lot of those limitations. Uh, they say that they have reached out to the FDA for comment on these new test results. They're waiting to hear back. In the meantime, they say if parents are concerned by this, to reach out to the FDA and ask them to add more strict requirements to what can be found in these juices. Definitely an eye-opening report. Elizabeth Campbell reporting to us live. Thank you. Mm -hmm.